things that we have tried. My little dude is officially potty trained. He has not had an accident in three months, so it can be done. He can be taught. Getting your kid started. A couple of weeks leading up to it, tell him, hey, you're gonna be potty trained. Hey, he's going on the big boy potty. He's just kind of planting the seed. I think we both know why I brought you here today. We need to discuss uh, potty training. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about that? Yeah. I'm, I'm glad to hear you say that because I've been kind of nervous. We both know that you're getting a little old now, huh? It's about that time that you need to stop going pee and poop in your diaper. Where should you start going pee and poop? Um, oh, no. In the toilet. We let him have a say in everything. Took him to go pick out underwear, made it like this big exciting thing, his own potty toilet, step stool he wanted to use, just so he kind of felt in control. I highly recommend doing that. Today is the first day of what? Thumbs up. Are you ready? We went to run some errands today on day one of potty training. Did we pee at Walmart on the floor? Yeah, we did. The next segment, the very first method is called the three day method. Essentially the idea is that your kid is naked for an entire three days. So you kind of got to clear your schedule and just stay home. And then you have like a potty training toilet, just like in your living room or wherever you are. When they do pee because they are naked, um, the pee will like run down their legs or like they can see it and associate that feeling with pee. Another method is to have a potty watch. Here's the one we use. I will link this down below. I will link everything down below, but you have a potty watch and you set it every 15 to 30 minutes or just even a timer. Every time it goes off, you just have them go and try to go potty. I, think I heard that a con for this method is that you're teaching them to empty their bladder even when it's not full because they get like rewarded when they do go. Um, even if it's just like a little tinkle. So the last method that I heard about, kind of just let them pee them. <laughs> you just kind of let them pee their pants. So the key is to make them clean themselves up. He would pee, I would make him pull down his own pee pants. He would have to go put it on top of the washer and then he would get a wet wipe and wipe his leg or he would get in the tub. The thought behind that is I think that they just get so sick of all the effort and it's like annoying. And so then they're like, I would rather go potty. Just go on the freaking toilet, man. Okay, switching gears. All of the different products that we used, gumball machine. I filled it with Skittles actually. We use this a lot because he hated even trying. So we had to reward him even when he would just like try to go on the toilet. This potty watch, which I showed you earlier, we love it. You can set a timer. It can go off 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour. And then a little song would play, kind of giving them control because it was on their wrist or they had it with them. This potty seat, um, like I said in the beginning, we let him pick like everything. There's a ton of different options I will link below. There's a bunch of girl options, boy options, gender neutral options. I really love this stool. We have this one actually downstairs. And then we have actually this stool upstairs. Some stools intimidate kids, some, you know, that's good to have options. We actually bought him this urinal thinking that he would be excited to pee standing up. He was not. These underwear, they're, I think they're technically called potty training underwear. Actually a little bit thicker. So if they do pee a little bit and then catch themselves and go, oh, I have to go potty. We have these in all the different characters, colors, whatever, what have you. I will link everything I just talked about down below in the description bar. Switching gears again. Next, my dude was 100% not ready. He was like the age where you are like, oh, he's not potty trained yet. Diapers are amazing. I freaking love that he was in diapers. It's so convenient for me. Mentally, I just don't think it was clicking for him. I think we struggled for like a solid month. The straw that broke the camel's back was when my husband, who is the sweetest, most patient man on the planet, was starting to get really frustrated. Let's call it. Let's just call it, take a big, big gap. A lot of people will say, don't do this. It ruins your momentum, all that stuff. I do not agree with that. I don't have any evidence to back it up, but I do not agree with that. Two to three months later, we tried again and it went a lot better. <sighs> okay, well, apparently she needs to be in here. Please do not let her darlingness distract from the message. The one thing we did not do is tell him to go potty. I think that was like, the huge thing that was like rubbing him the wrong way. And when he did pee his pants, we made him clean it up himself. Everywhere we went, we brought three pairs of underwear, three pairs of pants, a grocery sack to put his soiled stuff in, and then wet wipes to clean himself up. Here's what you've probably all been waiting for. What helped it finally click? One day he found a magazine on the floor. I don't even know where it came from. And in the magazine was a picture of a monster truck bed frame. He ripped the picture out of the magazine and he carried it everywhere in his little pocket. We were like, hey, 
we'll get this for you if you can go three days without peeing your pants. He went two and a half days, had one accident, and then we tried again, and he went three full days, and has not had one accident since. I don't know if it was the motivator. I don't freaking know what it was. All I know is he's potty trained now, and holy crap, that was a long process. We got her next. I will see you guys next week. Bye everyone, and good luck. monster truck ride. And look, when you go to bed at night, you can bring your monster trucks with you and put them up by you. Happy potty training! Are you so happy? Can you go potty in the toilet now like a big boy? No. What? <laughs> that was silly. Say, wait. Actually, yes, I can. So are you gonna relax? And Tayson, are you just gonna relax? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Glad that you guys like your new monster truck bed.